Hi, my name is Ayede. I'm an Abuja-based wedding photographer, and I would like to share with you uh, one of the latest line of photo books that my good pals over at Photo Niger have just rolled out. It's an incredible book. I like the product, and it has helped my marketing efforts greatly. So let me just um, walk you through the latest in the in the series of photo books that they have introduced, which are the flexible page magazine-style books. Um, not the old school, well now old school type books, um, the thick pages that we're, uh, that we're used to. So let me just show you um, what we've got here. Talk you through um, how it has made my marketing and my sales process a whole lot easier and why I think you too should consider it if you're a wedding photographer and you're looking for something new to, um, to add to your product lineup and to hopefully help you sell better. So this is a sample that I had made recently. It's, uh, this is actually something I'd already delivered before. Um, I, had, I had it made with the, with the old line of photo books that they made. That's the thick pages. And once uh, Simi got on the phone to tell me about this, I figured I'd go ahead and make a sample as well so I could show my clients just what we have available. So as you can see, this is 25 sheets. That's 50 pages. And as you can see, it's real uh, ultra thin. And then um, I don't know the technical terms. I, I mean, I don't know what the, they call this um, this finishing, this uh, cover. But as you can see, the cover is not um, not bad at all, made real nice. But the kicker here and the thing that um, my clients so far, when I go around marketing, what they really love is this um, ultra thin uh, magazine type um, pages. As you can see, the I mean these are real nice. Um, you can see that the quality of the paper is um, real good, and uh, of course, um, very thin. In the beginning, I must confess, I wasn't uh, keen on trying this out because, um, well, I'm kind of old school. But then again, my partner. That's my business partner who I've been shooting video with for a while right now. Thought uh, we need to add something to our lineup to um, to jazz up uh, the offering that we have with our clients. And uh, when my wife heard about uh, this new range of photo books, she didn't think it was a bad idea. And so we went ahead. So the reception since I've got this book has been fantastic. Um, clients really love the um, paper quality. And then... Uh, one bit of feedback that I've been hearing over and over again is how uh, this thin magazine style pages make the book really light and um, really light and portable and so that's what I've been hearing a lot light and portable as you can see I said at the beginning of the video this is what um, 25 sheets 50 pages looks like so it's a uh, um, it's a really it's a really nice book and that's been the, the key um, selling point that I've gotten so far in talking in discussing with clients so you've had a look at the book and um, you've got my feedback um, I think it's a really nice book and so if you're a wedding photographer looking to add something to your lineup or even if you're a corporate photographer this might not be a bad product uh, to roll out now why would I recommend it for other photographers out there I would roll it up uh, number one um, because of the increased options that it gives your clients and then number two most importantly this uh, book that Photo Niger has just rolled out seems to tap into um, a market base that has been dormant for a while in, uh, in Nigeria people who want the flexible magazine style type books people who don't want to um, carry around something too clunky and too chunky for their, for their wedding albums and I think this is catering to this need now, there's already been something out there in the market for a couple of years, maybe three, four years, what in Nigeria is called, popularly called the synth synthetic type photo books. But the problem that I have with the synthetic type photo books is that the, um, well, quite frankly, I think it looks um, cheap. And that's one of the reasons why I hadn't tried rolling it 